the uh, Ren Spooner 2012 Holiday Edition. <laughs> Red and white for the Bulldogs. First time you wore a Hawaiian shirt? First time? Oh, no, I've, I've got quite the collection at home. So, okay. Now, this is Rent Spooner. I've got a few of these. So They also make a 4th of July uh, annual shirt. So, I don't see any Bulldogs on there, though. They didn't make a <laughs> well, Hawaiian shirt guess, with a Bulldog? I guess, yeah. I'd go figure. You'd think I, it'd be a hot seller. I didn't know. First of all, uh, how was the trip? You enjoyed the flight? You, you get off, there's a sprinkle. Yeah, but, I mean, that's, that's how it is here. There's, there's always a sprinkle. That's why everything's green here. Uh, the weather's beautiful. It's what, about 75 degrees out. I think they said the low 70, the high is 79. So it's perfect, and our guys are uh, excited to be here and ready for you know the preparation and then the game on Monday. Coach, what was your message to the team when you had this this meeting right now? Well, the, the big message we we had a security meeting today was uh, as beautiful as this place is. There's a lot of distractions and a lot of potential uh, that that some you know other teams have have kind of fallen into some traps and. We're not going to do that. Uh, our guys know exactly how to act, and uh, we just wanted to reaffirm that with them, that uh, people here uh, are very, very friendly. Uh, the security here is, is, is no nonsense, and we just got to be very respectful. You've talked about having fun. Is there a fine balance? You, you want the guys to enjoy it, but still remember kind of why they're here? Oh, absolutely. You've got to do that all the time. What you've got to do is uh, always remember the task at hand, which is to win the game on Monday. But in the meantime, we're here for six days, and... It's a reward to go to bowl games, and so we'll have opportunities like tonight. We're going to have a nice uh, barbecue on the beach uh, for them to relax and enjoy themselves. But uh, tomorrow morning, uh, we'll be back to work, and we'll work in the morning, go to the uh, Pearl Harbor uh, uh, Memorial uh, tomorrow, and, and our guys will enjoy that and then relax in the afternoon. So it's, it's just going to be a good mix every day. How different is this experience compared to when you're coming out here to play Hawaii on a regular game and then being out here for a bowl? Well, it's, it's very different. When, when, you're, when you're coming on a, on a league game, uh, it's you fly out probably 48 or 24 hours before, and your only mission is to win a football game. When you come out for bowl games, it, it's a reward, and it should be. You get a chance to take in the local culture. Uh, I think you know, from an educational standpoint, getting our guys a chance to go to the Pearl Harbor Memorial and, and realize uh, what it was for for guys their age uh, to to you know perish in that you know attack and. You know, kind of, you know, taking the, the the sacrifices that that people made before them 70 years ago, and I think that'll be a big, you know, uh, educational experience for them that you, you probably don't get a chance to do just coming out here to play a game. Um, those kind of things are, 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 to me, invaluable about bowl games. If you get a chance to do that and experience the Hawaiian culture that you normally just see the inside of a hotel room and go practice and play a game. And uh, you know, there's a lot of events here, and you, mm -hmm. you, you have family around. You know, mm -hmm. how nice is that? For, you know, to have a family for for bowling. Well, I'll tell you, it's 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 a nice reward. Yeah, not just for our players, and our players' wives got a chance to come on this, but but our coaches, our coaches' families, and uh, uh, our administrators and, and support staff. You know, their families were able to come on out here, and so, uh, like I said, it's it's a great exclamation point to a, to a nice season. Uh, but but again, our our main objective is to win this tenth game. You're from uh, Southern Cal. We're going to see you uh, try to surf at all. Uh, it's been a long time since I've, I've been on a board, so uh, I don't know if we'll, we'll do it this trip. What about a boogie board? Yeah, I may get on a boogie board. Uh, yeah? Yeah, I, don't, I haven't seen a surf report, so we'll, we'll have to check it out. All right. we got a little bit of work to do in the afternoons. We, we practice in the morning, and in the afternoons, our coaches will be watching tape. Our players get a chance to relax. So once that's done, you know, you, you may catch me out there. I know your wife will be going shopping. Is there one I, thing? Don't remind that, me of that. Okay? <laughs> I know that. Uh, is there something that you specifically want to take home besides a win? Uh, no, I mean, that, that, that's all I concern myself. You know, uh, I want our guys to have a great experience. I'm not into trinkets and stuff, so <laughs> I'm sure she'll find some. But uh, uh, I just want to come back with a win and everybody healthy. What do you What do you hope your players get out of this this whole experience? Well, I, I think what they, they need to experience is, is the Hawaiian culture. Uh, they, they need to get a chance to, to go to Pearl Harbor and, and, and see, like I mentioned before, you know, the sacrifices that, that, our, that our American you know, service members had uh, made so that, that we can have the great country that we have. Uh, I think that's, that's very, very important. Um, but then on, on Monday, I expect our guys to, or practically on Sunday, get into game mode that that last 24 hours be very, very focused on you know, a really good SMU team and, and playing at our best so that our guys will remember this game the rest of their lives. And you want to be, you know, remembering a win, especially for these 22 seniors, uh, not, you know, falling short of that. Guys, it's a coach.